Dear students, from today we are starting to discuss in detail different groups available in insert ribbon. So let's start with the first functionality or group available in the insert ribbon known as page group. And today's topics would be cover page, blank page and page break. So let's start. So we are on a blank page at the moment and this is the page group available over here and this page group has three options one is cover page the next is blank page and the next is page break so from cover page it means that for example if you want to decorate your main cover page of your document so then there are different decorations available on cover page so for example if i click on this menu button of cover page i can have number of options available so for example if i say okay i like this kind of page and if i click on this so this mean that my first page of the document would be like this and here of course I can change the topic and topic is like ITC course and subtitle is page group which we are discussing and there could be some other things which we can add like who is the author administrator what is the date if you want to add for example you say okay add here the today's date and any course title if you want to add you can add okay hello so this would serve as the cover page of your document so this means that you can quickly generate cover page with available templates so for example if I change like this so you can see that on the cover page there would be a very good picture on the top and then itc course and then abstract and etc etc so let's try to add the same thing onto our other document on which we were working so this is the second document on which we were working so let's try to add a cover page over here as well so i need something like for example this one yes so you can see that this has become the cover page and the first page of those 26 pages have been shifted to the second page so now our 26 page document has become 27 page document and the first page is the cover page all right so next is the blank page so if you want to add a blank page anywhere in the content you can add it wherever you want so for example let's move to the our document and i want a blank page over for example here so i go over here i say okay i need a blank page so it has shifted all of the content to the next to next page so in between this and this keyword there is a blank page which has been inserted as you can see over here and keyword has been shifted to next to next page so this is a blank page which has been added and then you can also add page break which means end the current page here and moves to the next page so in a blank page it was possible that we could write over here but when we say that end this page over here and then move to the next page so if i click over here so it has not added any blank page instead the current page has ended over here right and 
you can see now with this that this is a page break so this is the hidden symbols which we learned sometime in the home ribbon so it is saying that this is a page break over here so anything after this has been shifted to the next page so we have learned cover page blank page and page break so let's summarize today's module today we have learned and we have experimented on the first group known as page group on the insert ribbon and we have discussed cover page and blank page and page break so in the next modules we will move forward to the next group available in the insert ribbon